Hi everyone, we hope all of you are doing well and we're glad to see you at our poster presentation. I am Balkhabia Karujan. I am Amon Yudhiv Sungla. And I am Ayoskar Bekov. So let's start. Uh, shortly we want to start with our outline. This is our outline as you see. It's about introduction, critical incident, learning objectives, outcomes, challenges, and finally, final products. <sighs> Yeah, thank you, Idos. And in today's globalized world, it's becoming increasingly important to be able to interact effectively and appropriately with people who are um, culturally different from ourselves. And being interculturally competent needs uh, like openness, curiosity, flexibility, and problem solving skills that form part of the buy of 21st century skills and the theory of please next and the theory of pbl is based on learning by doing students face real life real world problems through projects and see challenges that uh, have to face that they have to face in the real life and they learn uh, by capturing real world problem which provokes Critical thinking and development of real life skills. Thank you. Okay, that's why we have chosen critical incident, which is relevant in our life. Uh, our critical incident happened in Metro in Brussels. Three young Chinese people entered the Metro and they were shouted, they were discriminated by a woman who was standing there. But bystanders, they took their positions, fortunately, and they, they wanted to stop, they wanted to seize the racism that was happening around the world. So, next yeah, slide, please. Why is it important for us? Because uh, this critical incident, this racism is uh, starting to spread around the world because of the appearance of uh, coronavirus uh, that happening that originated uh, from China, Wuhan. So we want to raise tolerance in our students and uh, we want to prepare them uh, to face those kind of uh, anticipated uh, discriminations that, might, that they might face uh, when they are abroad. So next speech. Uh, and what about the learn objectives? Actually, they are quite simple. First of all, uh, we wanted to raise awareness on race critical incidents related to COVID-19. Also to familiarize with interpreting of such incidents from victim's point of view and share a role model that could make a difference in similar situations. Also to make aware of unacceptability of reacting passively to such kind of situations, uh, which are based on racial discrimination anywhere, including students' Poland and its living city. Uh, what about the language, the language objective? It was actually also uh, quite simple. Uh, the topic is reported fit. That's why we wanted uh, to learn students uh, how to accurately deliver someone's work without quoting them. So, <clears throat> with the help of this project-based learning, PBL, we understood how to work together, which makes it possible to work in any team smoothly in the future, uh, which is really helpful. And second, we learn, uh, learn to reckon with each other and to be tolerant of each other's opinions. We learn to communicate with each other. Uh, it's like... And communication is not just only ability to um, talk with each other, but to find like the way how to communicate, how to talk to other person. And uh, we have achieved a more accurate and correct result by working together. And we learned how to distribute the task, uh, taking into account the nature of each participant. Thank you. Thank you, Arjan. And however, of course, we had some challenges. For instance, uh, excessive time has been spent on attempts just to get focused. Uh, you know, what, what was the problem? The problem was in uh, 
all of us are friends actually uh, i mean we we were friends before the project and you know we, we just counted and realized that we had spent at least eight hours for one page of the unit and half of this time has been spent just on talking just on uh, just on nothing you know and and that's funny because we tried just to get focused and that that was a problem for us uh another problem here is uh, okay as you see it's about coronavirus and you know what um because of coronavirus we had to we had to collaborate only through internet and some of our members sometimes had problems with uh, internet connection and that created some issues i would say thank you Ados. okay now it's our final product uh, we have created Steven's book where we added all four skills and where we uh, presented the coronavirus and the, the way how to get rid of racism that might appear even in our uh, Kazakhstan, in our country. So Steven's books uh, were prepared well and we added everything, every single aspect of language and uh, we added four skills, listening, writing, reading, and speaking, and we added also vocabulary. Okay, next. Also, we have created teaching guideline which will facilitate a teacher's job uh, because we have added their all exercises and their answers, and um, uh, it will be useful. It will be useful for students and uh, for teachers. Next, please. Also, we have created our presentation for lesson. Also, we added our jokes, and it's entertaining for students and teachers, uh, where we also uh, try to present the coronavirus and that's uh, consequences that might happen in our world. Next, please. Then the last one is ICC project that we we are so thrilled uh, to share it with you and we are so happy that uh, we have collaborated a lot and uh, at last we achieved our goals in this course. Okay. So, uh, thank you so much. <laughs> <clears throat> We hope that uh, you will like our video and please, if you like it, like it. Yeah, and please leave a comment below and see you next video.